Right, Libra, this is going to be your uh, May reading, all about you. It's going to be for your sun, moon, and rising. Uh, if you don't know what they are, you have to uh, download your birth chart and it will tell you. Uh, okay. Oh, if you don't resonate with this, look back a few months and the playlist for Libra. And if you could like and share, that would be great. And subscribe. If, oh, thank you if you have already. Right, let's go. Libra Sun, Moon, and Rising. Right, bottom of the pile. So you've got the three of earth. So that is, um, it's like a veil over something at this time. It's like something's not being seen for what it really is. But there's a lot going on in the background. Like the whole city in the background. But it's like fog. So you can't see anything. That could involve a Leo. With the strength card there. I was seeing that one as well. Like she, that lion's roaring at her to not take an apple. And there's something dark in this corner. So that could be relevant. There could be messages coming in at this time. You could be messaging someone. Like, they are messages of love, but it's with no emotion. Yeah, and that could have been because of some sneaky behaviour that went down on a soulmate relationship. Uh, could have involved a Leo. Someone could have been being very generous and left somebody in their head up of a night time. And they could have been because of some messages of truth that have been had on a situation where somebody was drowning in their emotions and their soulmate was watching them, yeah. Somebody could want to come in with a really long stick of an apology on some illusions and lies that could involve an Aries. Or at least Aries, Leo or Sagittarius, normally my Aries. Someone's got a big love heart. Yeah, maybe somebody got on made a choice between two things and they, they're riding solo to come and uh, see you Libra yeah got in their chariot made a decision they're not actually moving forward yet they want to have a new beginning with stability could involve a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio or it could be that somebody's controlled their emotions like meditated on something yeah, because somebody's uncertain, won't make a choice, they're holding something very precious, but they've, eh, they've got something on their eye level that's, that's keeping them busy, put it that way, yeah, and they could have a lot of choices as well, they could also have the guard at this time, could be a Virgo, Taurus or Capricorn, yeah, somebody's been working on their money, somebody also got in their boat and they moved away to what they thought was greener grasses, but they got enlightened now and they're in the handman. Yeah, and that could be because they were looking at their ships coming in. Maybe they were looking at an Aries that looks like a Leo. Because in that card, it's the Empress, which is Aries. But it's a Leo, yeah. Could definitely be an Aries with a magician coming up straight afterwards. Or Virgo, or even a uh, Gemini. Yeah, there's going to be an end of them cycles, though. This family situation where the, the light, you know, the actual... He's got this Buddha there, but he's got... um a string of lights in his hand and the chains broke so it lights out isn't it yeah and that could cause heartbreak in the situation cause somebody to have to have a new beginning it's not a complete ending yet because ten, ten of swords has been reversed so either it's yeah it's not done Can't, somebody could be ignoring a situation that's why it could actually involve a leo with the queen of wands there and a virgo so somebody could have shut the door, but they've left the key on the on the front of the door, and that could involve a high priestess. It could also involve um, a Pisces, someone that knows secrets, doesn't say them though. Yeah, and a very single energy. Somebody wants to call you, and that could be with messages of passion, having a new beginning with passion, reigniting something that you've been in your head about. Yeah, so that's all amazing can be used for their star leader. They want to send you a message of stability. Somebody's very in tune. Yeah, and a message of love to their soulmate, or so they think. 
one of the higher level of commitment. They're probably going to explain they've been dancing in their clouds in their head for a while. They could be a fire sign because message of fire. They could be quite snotty when they want to be, yeah. And they could have been juggling a few things, keeping a few things all afloat at once. Yeah, there could be a pregnancy from that situation as well, and a blessing. I don't know where the wheel of fortune's moved now, yeah, because somebody was blindfolding themselves to a tree, so it could have involved a Gemini and definitely a Leo. Yeah, definitely a Gemini, Queen of Air. Well, that's you, Libra, and you knew psychically. Maybe about somebody going off and having recognition and reward, or you doing that. Yeah, on a on a some somebody you even could have lived with. Yeah, there wasn't a transformation in the situation. It could have involved Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. It could have been a lot of messages going on between the two of you. Yeah, on like a single energy. No, that's juggling. Or somebody could have been juggling. Yeah, that's the truth. Somebody was definitely trying to keep something afloat. Somebody had to drop some burdens, and that could have been a, you know, a soulmate relationship. Definitely a soulmate past life relationship. Somebody's walked away from that, and that was because their intuition told them something about justice coming in. Yeah, somebody had to shed their skin and, and heal, basically, and somebody had to be very patient while that person did that. Right, what's the first one? Page of fire. I see that one as like there's been a big war going behind it, but um, someone's like coming in from a lot of battles maybe, Freemasonry could be one of them, May, Virgo's son, somebody wants to leave and this person's lost the plot, mind manipulator, hormone injections, evil eye on you, <laughs> and Aries ascending. Or somebody's got five heads will still be wanting to know what you're doing, yeah. You may need some therapy, cancer, dark skinned, and the sun, which is Leo. Yeah, which is the sun. Father can be relevant. Yeah, God, <laughs> the sun. Shagging multiple work colleagues. Yeah, no rest for the wicked, Pisces. Uh, someone else really digging men these days. Cancer moon. And your XX is ma is involved in this somehow. And now they want to talk, honey. No rest for the wicked. They all want your brown bread and Leo ascendant. Could be one of them. Right, Libra, let's do page of fire. This is what's going on in you at this time. So you could feel like you've been in battle with somebody, like in war. Like somebody's blowing up all around them. All around you, maybe. Yeah, you could be wanting balance in the situation. You could be dealing with Sagittarius, someone with Sagittarius in their chart. Yeah, it could be over some money as well. You could be getting a blessing from somebody, from an old man, maybe. Yeah, on a family situation where somebody was enlightened to the truth, but they hung upside down. Yeah, and that caused heartbreak. It also caused somebody to be blindfolded to the truth. Capricorn could have been involved, or it could have been somebody you're sexually currently tied to. Yeah, you could like be coming out a bit crying over spilled milk by now as well. Right, for uh, that's normally your this is what you're being seen like. Maybe you're being seen somebody's coming in with an apology and being very guarded, or you're doing that, yeah. And then some single energy, nine of pentacles. You could have kept on fighting with this person, you could have had to put your guard up. Could have been a Gemini, it could have been a Virgo or an Aries with a magician card there, but that had to be a complete ending, or there was. There's judgment coming in on a, child, a situation with a child as well. Yeah, and that's the truth. There's going to be a lot of messages, and they come, could come from a Leo. Yeah. Or a Queen of Wands, yeah. Somebody, you want to have a new beginning with love, maybe? Yeah, and then we've got justice. So I feel like justice is coming in. I feel like you might be going back somewhere from the past or something you've you've kind of had a new think, a new look on, maybe Libra. Yeah, on a choice between two lovers, maybe a Gemini was involved. Doesn't have to be. So you've been in your head about the situation, definitely, because it could be like a one year old child involved in this situation. There's a big red flag around that one year old child as well, Libra. Maybe you made a choice but you've been stuck to something in the past. Yeah, and that could all be over messages of um, 
truth coming in like sh and they'll be spoken sharply what your secret is Libra is ten of pentacles lots of money in this one she's like a single woman looking really pissed off and she's got loads of money but she's got a dog sitting next to her but she's miserable as sin she don't look happy so that could be your secret i don't know yeah then we've got the chariot card somebody could be making a decision maybe after they've walked away or they're walking away somebody's not actually got in their in their chariot and gone yet though yeah and that could be because of a gemini leader or aquarius somebody could know the truth but want the truth and be cutting something like that could be you libra yeah could involve a virgo taurus or capricorn october could be relevant and how dumb are these people for real yeah 12 has which is pisces karma um maybe that Hidden enemies, yeah, reconciliate, reconciliation, yeah, confinement, rebirth, sacrifice, surrender, intuitions, collective unconscious. How dumb are these people for real in October? And well, I have we're all having fun, and then the sun could be relevant, yeah. This King of Pentacles. There could be an ending happening with this situation of all these people that are involved because it seems like there's quite a lot. There could be a Cancer, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and now a Scorpio. But it seems to be an ending of the situation, so somebody can have a new beginning. A Leo ascendant could be relevant, and Hex and Curse return to the sun. But why you're keeping that a secret is because you've got temptations, <laughs> Libra. Yeah. Yeah, you want recognition of a reward maybe in a situation, but you move very slowly towards something, or it could be a younger air sign, a regular towards a cup and there could be now a message of in a cup about a pregnancy, or even a child that's already here, but it may be coming, yeah. And it could be something that's left you very uncertain. Yeah, witness protection. They want to get even dead or alive. Jupiter, the Madge, Pisces, Control Freak. Your person's doing black magic doll and the letter L. And this person's gone insane with magic, yeah. Right, these are messages of truth. It's on your conscious mind, so you're sending a message of truth. Or somebody is, yeah. Or something you consider to be a blessing. Yeah, there you are. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, yeah, and it could be involving the Cancer Pisces or Scorpio or somebody who's controlled their emotions. Like, she's actually got her feet out of the water completely. So, whoever that is has got no emotion at this time. They could even be ignoring you, Libra. Yeah, and that could have been because of choices and maybe even a Virgo. It doesn't have to be there. Somebody's shown a light in the situation. He's got a big stick. Snake on his stick, yeah. Somebody could have been offering, like, love as well, like divine love or. Yeah, but somebody that was an indifference anyway, somebody didn't want that. And yeah, it could have been involved with money and somebody being very guarded over what they've got, what they want. Yeah. <laughs> what they're doing with that. Right, let's do this tower. This is what's in your heart, Libra, is knowing that there's a facade to pull down on the front of the tower. Yeah. Uh, you could be wanting to go in with an apology to somebody very slowly. Maybe that's what you know. This old stuff needs to be pulled down. Whatever is being done needs to come down. Yeah, and end of the world. Last card in tarot. End of these cycles. You need to move away from a situation that was keeping your head of a nightclub anyway. Just, yeah, keeping yourself in the same place. And it definitely could involve a Leo. Because it keeps coming up. Somebody could be an alcoholic, somebody's lying on you, then judging you on their lies, a murder most foul, your own family cursed you, August, and take care of financial needs, March, we focus definitely the shit, and there's a lot of hidden fuck buddies. Yeah, there's also going to be a message of truth about these things, or is a message of truth coming from that person? Yeah, about this juggling that went down. Uh, 
yeah, Aries could be relevant and dirty old dog could rat and Pluto could be relevant. Yeah, this is something you keep going back to. It definitely could be a Virgo Taurus or Capricorn because that's in your soul. That's that's kind of where you want to be. Yeah, you could be feeling like you have to guard yourself at this time a little bit as well. Yeah, from maybe even a Gemini or Virgo or Taurus. Something about a blessing as well, Libra. Something where you kept on going back for a bite of the cherry. Yeah, admiring you from afar. Good news uh, is coming in. Magnetic connection. Talk about your feelings. And decide it's time to clearly make a decision uh, about what you want. And joy and happiness are the key. Right, the last one is you. It's your outcome. So, he can be quite cold, quite stern. Maybe that's what you're being at this time. Maybe even with uh, Aries, Leo or Sagittarius. But normally my Aries card, yeah. Somebody will probably give you a bit of heartbreak. And a Leo could be involved with the sun. But maybe a Leo show a light in the situation. But yeah, over one night stand energy maybe. Yeah. Could have involved a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio. Somebody made a choice between two things. And uh, yeah. Definitely sending like passionate messages. Uh, it's going to be a new beginning with stability. After you send a message of truth, and that could bring you in recognition and reward. So, I mean, somebody's gonna send you a, a message of truth to get recognition and reward, or you're gonna do that, Libra. Yeah, over a couple of lovers all over Flayed now, over these illusions and lies. There needs to be an ending to the situation. It can be a death there, to be honest. And that could be on a family situation where two people are hiding a key to a house as well. That keeps coming up. Yeah. Something where somebody was looking at their ships coming in. Could be a Capricorn with a devil card there. Somebody you could have been like addictions, things you do too much of, yeah. But could you, somebody could be wanting to send a little apology and that could be a Virgo or that could be something somebody shone a light on and that could be over somebody guarding some money where there needs to be a complete end, ending on a family situation. And I'm thinking I'm going to leave it there. Anyway, love and light. Take care, Libra. Bye-bye.